What's up, YouTube family? Welcome back or welcome to Lin Lin. Thank you guys so much for coming to check out the video today. I'm pretty sure you guys can see the sun shining behind me. It's so beautiful out here this morning already. It's early in the morning, but the sun is shining and it just puts me in such a great mood. I mean, this is Oregon. I'm in a rainy state, but it feels so good to finally get some sun, to finally see some to finally see some sun and it is going to be nice all weekend which is great because today is my husband's birthday so I am celebrating him today and I am headed into Winko right now because I want to go get all the things that I need and then I want to see if they have cakes in there but I usually get my cakes from either um Albertsons or Fred Meyers and we don't need a big cake because it is just the six of us so I pretty much just like to get a cake where we can all get like one piece and then the cake is done. Let's go. All right, guys. So my first stop is gonna be in Winco this morning. It is such another beautiful day out. You see that? Not a cloud in the sky. The sun is shining. I am so glad that spring weather is finally here. I was so sick of the rain, guys. You just don't know. So spring is finally coming. All right, we're gonna go in here and see what we can find. So some of the things that I wanna get is like I said, I wanna do kind of like a fruit tray, kind of like a veggie tray, things like that. I wanted to do a charcuterie board, but I could not find a board. So I'm just settling for trying to make a tray of some kind of little platter. So the main thing that I'm in here to get right now is like some fruit and some vegetables and some of his favorite things that he likes. Strawberries are still 248 in here. So I'm gonna get a couple of these because of course the strawberries that I had are already gone. These ones look good. Okay, so I got a couple strawberries. I don't see any blueberries. The raspberries are a little bit expensive in here. They're 327. The blackberries don't have a price on them. So I'm gonna stick with the strawberries and then I think I'll grab some grapes as well. As far as vegetables go, I have cucumbers already. Um, I'll grab a celery. The celeries are a dollar and 28 cents for a celery. And then I want to grab a couple broccolis. All right, I got my broccoli. Now let's see how much these grapes are. They have the black seedless grapes, 348, the red globe seeded grapes, 348, then the green ones for 298, and the red grapes for 298 as well. I think I'm gonna grab a mixture of both the green. Now I don't want a big bag of them, just enough. Okay, I'll go with this bag right here, the green grapes. And then I think I'll get a bag of the red ones as well. Get a little bag of the red ones. So I got red grapes and green grapes. Now I already have a pineapple that I have not cut yet. They are in here for $1.98 still. I'm coming this way because I need to grab some water. The last time I came, I grabbed five waters and all five of those waters are gone already. So, but literally every time I come to Winko, I have to grab some waters because we go through the water so fast. I use them to cook with and I also use them to drink my tea, all that stuff. So I'm always buying waters and they are always fully stocked with the waters. So I'm gonna grab another five of these today. Uh, 
I'm actually glad there's no limit on the water. There used to be, I mean, I guess back when COVID was going on, there used to be a limit on the water. You could only get like four of them at a time, sometimes only two, but now there is no limit to the water, which is good. Okay, so I just grabbed some Ritz crackers. That's another one of his favorite crackers is Ritz crackers. So I grabbed one of those. These are 328 in here. Another thing he likes right here is this armor, sa armor sausage. These are 398 in here for this one, which is a good price because as you can see at Walmart, Fred Meyers, um, they are either 630 or 499. So these are only 398 in here. So I'm gonna grab one of those as well. <clears throat> now I'm gonna come back over to the produce because I wanna see if they have a bag of cauliflower as well. I didn't see it over here the first time. So I'm gonna double back over here to see if I can find some cauliflower. All right, here we go. Cauliflower right here. I really didn't want a big head of it, but the bags are much more expensive, so I am gonna grab one of these. These are $1.28. So now I got cauliflower, I got broccoli, I got some summer sausage, I have cucumbers at home, I have a pineapple at home, I have strawberries and grapes. I really would have preferred to have another fruit, um, like some berries, but they don't have anything anything that I want really the raspberries are a little expensive and actually the last time I got the blueberries they were not good I need to grab some lemons of course and they are still 38 cents as always I'm gonna grab 10 of these so I'm coming over here to the bulk foods and candies there's these dark chocolate peanut type things that he likes I wanna see if I can find those. Make sure they're actually the same ones. Um, those are dark chocolate mint cookie, chocolate covered cherries. They're little clusters of chocolate and they are actually dark chocolate. So I wanna say they might be in here. Ah, here we go. Dark chocolate peanut clusters. These are 3.98 a pound. So I'm gonna get some of these for them. All right, got the chocolates. That's probably about a pound. I don't know, I don't never weigh them or anything, but if it's a little more, a little less, that's okay. So guys, my idea is to make something similar to these things right here, but I definitely don't wanna pay $11.98 for one of them. That's why I said I would do it myself because I don't know, these things just aren't really worth paying this much for. I mean, these ones are a little cheaper. These are $7.48. And you know what? I probably could just get one of those and come out a little bit cheaper. But, you know, I kind of just want to make it myself. This right here is a veggie tray. This is $10.98 for this. For, for the veggies, I'm pretty sure I could come out cheaper making the veggie trays myself. But for these ones like this, um, I don't know. I don't know. I guess I need to compare the prices. But... Like I said, I kind of just rather make it myself. That way I have exactly what I want in it. But these are all between $7.48, $11.98. Another thing that I want to do actually is like um, little pinwheels, like the uh, tortilla with the cheese and the meat in it. So I have some pepper turkey still at home that I haven't used all of yet. So I think I might make those as well. And actually I might have tortillas still at home too. So that works out perfectly. So the only thing that I'll need to get is some cheese. So I'll get this sharp cheddar cheese right here. This is 16 slices and I can cut these into fours, you know. Yeah, so I think I'll get these, cut these into fours to make the pinwheels and to make um, part of the cheese platter as well. That cheese is 422. I wanna say that might be the best deal because these ones only have 12 slices those ones have 16 uh, these ones have 18 but those are the thin sliced ones so yeah I'm gonna just go with those ones for 422 so guys one of the other things that I want to check out is a cake 
I'm gonna see what kind of cakes they have in here, but usually I go to Albertsons or um, Fred Meyers. Okay, here we go for their cakes. So their cakes are $22.99. We don't need a cake this big because it's only the six of us. They do have a nice variety. Eight. This one right here is a variety cake. This is cool. Lemon, carrot, strawberry, and white. All those four in there. That one is $15.98. They got Boston cream pies, $9.98. And those are red velvets for $12.98. So these ones aren't bad. This is a variety one as well. $16.98 for caramel, red velvet, chocolate, and carrot. These ones over here, caramel cake, $12.98. Cookies and cream for $9.98. $13.98, $12.98. Their prices are pretty good. Um, I wanna say Albertsons is pretty much the same as well. Uh, Fred Meyers, I don't remember their prices, but I'm gonna go check them out. Okay guys, so I think I have everything I need to make these little trays possible. I got the sausage, got the cauliflower, some ranch, pepperonis, Ritz crackers. I got his favorite little um, chocolates there. I got some strawberries down there, grapes. The lemons don't count, but I got lemons and I got some cheese. And then like I said, everything else I already have at home. So I'm gonna go and pay for this stuff and then head to the next store, guys. All right, guys, so I just left out of Winko and I spent a total of $53.91. I don't need anything else to go with my platters or go with any of the things that I'm gonna put on the platter. My sole purpose now is to go find a cake. All right, guys, so let's head into Fred Meyers and see what kind of cakes we can find. Let's go. I don't know why, but it just seemed a little busier that way. So I'm just gonna go in through this way, which is like the garden center way, I guess, because the garden center's over there. So, I'm gonna go in and have to go all the way around to the other side, but that's okay. They have some nice patio sets in here. This one right here is $8.99. This table set right here is pretty cute. That's $8.99 as well. They have a few of them in here. I really like um, the furniture in Fred Meyers. I actually bought my couch from Fred Meyers. And when I bought it, it was half off. It was right before um, Black Friday and it was half off. And so it was originally like 16, 1700 and I only paid like 700, 600 or something like that. And it's a sectional. So it was actually a pretty good deal. They have really nice furniture here, especially when you can catch them on sale. Guys, we're over here by the cakes. Let's see what they have. $8.99. I think this is just a half. This is a white, all white cake. This one right here is a this one right here is a carrot cake. These are all $8.99. This one's a lemon cake. This one is a cream cake. The ones back there are chocolate. Those aren't bad. I also have those ones down there at the bottom. Those are all $15.99, but those are the bigger ones as well. And they have these ones over here. Now these are way bigger than what I want. And these ones are all $29.99 for these. They have fruit tarts in here for $19.99 for those ones. The little ones are $4.99. These are just slices of cake right here. $4.99 for those. That one's $17.99 down there, $17.99. Tress Witches, $17.99. These big ones right here are $34.99. This little cake right here is, uh, I don't see the price on this one, but I want something like this, where it's small like this, but you can also write on it as well. So I think I'm gonna just head over to Albertsons and see what they have over there. Hopefully I can find one at Albertsons because they have these ones in here as well. These are little ones. These are these are not bad. These are seven dollars. These are little carrot cakes. Um 
chocolate celebration cake. This one's $7. So, I mean, I could get one like this. I don't know. This one's a cookies and cream cake. You know what? I could probably just get candles and put the candles on there. I wanted to say, like, we love you or something like that. Happy birthday. Something. I'm going to head to Albertsons and see what they have. Oh, what is this one? This one's $15. These are all cold cakes. So guys, I see a couple cakes, but you know, when you're buying things like that, you kind of want to get what you really want. And I don't see what I really, really want. So I'm just going to head over to Albertsons and hopefully I can find something there. If not, then I'll have to make a trip back up here to grab one of those cakes that I seen that were $7. But hopefully I can find something at Albertsons, guys. All right, so let's go over to Albertsons and see what they have over there. Okay, so I said I was gonna go to Albertsons to look for a cake, but Safeway was right across from Fred Meyers as well. Well, it's actually right down the street. So I'm gonna go in here and see if they have a cake in here before I head to Albertsons. I'm not even sure where their bakery is in here. I haven't been in this store forever. It's not this way. Okay, so I came the wrong way. I have been shopping Safeway for a long time. Do you guys shop at Safeway? I kind of stopped shopping in here because I started feeling like their prices were a little bit too high. And I guess if you're getting discounts on some stuff using coupons and things like that, it may not be as high. But it's been a long, long time since I've shopped in here. Okay, so they have a nice cake department. Oh, look, they have all these St. Patrick's Day cookies and cupcakes. See, these are nice. I like this little rainbow one. That's cute. This is exactly what I'm looking for, guys. I'm glad I came over here. I'm looking for like a blank canvas to be able to write on. These ones right here are $15. These are all $15, $15. I'm gonna come look over here and see what they have over here first. They have all these ones in here. These are all $15. These are just slices over here. These are $5.99 for those big slices. I'm glad I came over here. They have all these ones in here. These are big ones, so I don't want anything this big, but these are all 12, 28. I usually buy one like these ones right here. Those are $12, but they only have those two in there. And like I said, I kind of want something written on it, so they got that one down there for 15. That one's 15 as well. Those are cute. So you know what? I think I'm gonna come back over here where the St. Patrick's Day cakes are and see if I can get someone to write something on it for me. I know he doesn't want that decoration. Green is good though. Actually, green is his favorite color. So I'm pretty sure he would prefer a chocolate over a vanilla. This has a little St. Patrick's Day thing. See, that's the thing with his birthday being the day before St. Patrick's Day. I always run into getting these kind of cakes because this is usually what they have. So I like this one right here, guys. What do you guys think about this one? And they have this one as well. They're all $15, so either one. I think I like this one because it's white up here and it would look better with the writing. So I think I'm gonna get this one and have them write on it. Hopefully someone's back here to write on it. Well, they have these ones over here as well. Oh, this one's all messed up. This one's half off. Those ones are half off probably because they cracked in the middle of them. We got some cupcakes down there, some nut-free cupcakes, unicorn cupcakes. 
carrot rolls. These are just some cupcakes. I do not like these frosted cookies. Do you guys like these? This frosting on these are so sweet. I've never seen the key lime and I've never seen the orange cream ones. Those ones are different. Got some baklava. I've never tried that either. Okay, thank you. You too. Okay, so this is the cake. It says we love you. That's all I wanted it to say. I didn't want it to say happy birthday or anything. I just wanted something simple. So I got my simple cake. It says we love you. Now I gotta get some candles. So I said I didn't have any more stops, but I actually need to go to the dollar store now because there's a couple of things that I need to grab from the dollar store as well. And I have to grab some candles from there. So guys, let's pay for this and then head to the dollar store. All right, guys, at my last stop, which is Dollar Tree. Gotta go in here and grab a few things. I know I need some candles and a couple other things. I want to grab some paper plates, a tablecloth. Um, might as well grab some silverware. Let's see, there's 48 in this one. Grab some silverware, green tablecloth. Here's candles. I don't want candles that say his age. He'll kill me if I get candles that say his age. What is this? Balloon art strip. So we'll just get some regular candles. Well, these ones that say happy birthday are pretty cool too. You know what? I'll go with these ones. These ones say happy birthday. So I'll grab these ones. Regular green plates. We'll keep it green. I don't know why I came in here. I don't know why I came in here and didn't grab a basket. I uh, honestly don't know why I did that. But I'm gonna grab some tissue paper down there as well. So I had to go grab a basket. I said I wasn't coming in here to get a lot of stuff, but this is Dollar Tree and that almost never ends up happening. I had about five things in my hand that I was dropping all over the place. So I went and grabbed a basket. I'm looking for some toothpicks because that's what I'm gonna use to keep the pinwheel um, little sandwiches together. So I need to find some toothpicks. I hope they have them in here actually. Here we go. Two picks, 500 count of these. So I think I got everything I need. I got a gift bag. I got the tissue paper, I got some candles, toothpicks, plastic plates, I got a tablecloth, silverware, and I think the last thing I'm gonna grab is some paper towels. So guys, I'm gonna head to the register and let me see if they have a couple balloons. And they do. They got some green ones at that. I think I'm gonna grab a couple of the green ones and then oh, maybe this one right here this one says celebrate and then a couple of these green ones as well okay guys that is the end of the video i got my last couple things at dollar tree and i spent 15 dollars, well 14 dollars and some change at dollar tree so i ended up going to five different stores to get everything that I needed to get for his birthday. I ended up going to Ross as well and I got him some essentials. So guys, that is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for coming with me and shopping with me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video.